going to model for you how we do subtraction. But firstly, do you remember what it means to subtract? Come on, think. Are you thinking take away? Well, you are correct. To subtract means to take away. And you will notice that when we take away, that we end up with a quantity less than what we started with. So let's get started with our activity. So we begin with our number story. Let's read. In my basket, I have seven blocks. Two blocks fell out of my basket. How many blocks remained in my basket? Hmm. There's my basket, and there are my seven blocks. So boys and girls, I am going to show you how we do subtraction. It said that I had seven blocks in my basket. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven blocks are in my basket, but two fell out. So I am going to subtract or take away two. One, two. How many blocks are in my basket? Let's count. One, two, three, four, five. Seven, take away two equals five. So let's look at our screen. Here are all my blocks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Two blocks fell out. One, two. I count the blocks that are left. One, two, three, four, five. Five blocks are left. Seven, take away two, equals five. So, did you notice what I did? Well, let's do one together. Get ready. Here's our number story. In a cup, there are five markers. I remove three of the markers from the cup. How many markers are left in the cup? There's my cup, and there are my five markers. I'm going to my table so I can show you how to solve this. Now, I don't have any markers today, but I have counters, and I'm going to use my counters. So I have five markers. One, two, three, four, five. Five markers in all. I remove three of my markers. One, two, three. How many markers are left? One, two. Five, take away three, equals two. Let's go to the screen. Here are all my markers. One, two, three, four, five. I remove three markers. One, two, three. I count the markers that are left. One, two. Two markers are left. Five, take away three, equals two. Let's do another one. Marie had eight stamps. She gave four stamps to Linda. How many stamps does she have left? There are my eight stamps. Or well, not my eight stamps, but Marie's eight stamps. So I am going to get my eight 
stamps, but I don't have stamps, I'm going to use my counters. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All of the stamps, eight. The problem said that she gave away four stamps. So I'm going to take away four. One, two, three, four. Boys and girls, how many stamps are left? I count to find that out. One, two, three, four. There are four stamps left. Let's go to the screen. So here are all my stamps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Give away four stamps. One, two, three, four. I count the stamps that are left. One, two, three, four. Four stamps are left. Eight, take away four, equals four. Now, boys and girls, I have my buddy Charlie right here with me. You are going to work with your buddy. Now, remember, your buddy is your mommy, your sister, brother, granny, uncle, auntie, whoever is there that can help you with our problems. Let's get ready. I will read the number story. There were nine paper clips in a bowl. Three of the paper clips were removed from the bowl. How many paper clips are left in the bowl? Now, there are my nine paper clips. I'm going to use my counters to help you boys and girls solve this number story. So I have nine. I'm going to use my red counters this time. One, two, Three, I want you to count. Did you get nine? Let's make sure. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine. And three paper clips were removed. So I take away three. One, two, three. How many paper clips are left? How do I find that out? I count. One, two, three, four, five, six. Nine, take away three equals six. Let's go to our screen. Here are all the paper clips, all nine. One, two, three, four, five, nine. Good job, boys and girls. I remove three paper clips. One, two, three. I count the paper clips that are left. One, two, three, four, five. Six. Six paper clips are left. Nine take away three equals six. Now, you do alone, but don't worry, I am here with you. Let's see if you can solve this number story. I will read for you. There were four butterflies in the garden. One of the butterflies flew away. How many butterflies are still in the garden? Look at those lovely butterflies. Four of them are there, one flew away. We use our counters to solve. How many butterflies were there at first? Four. One, two, three, four. And one flew away. So what am I going to do? Yes, I'm going to take away one. How many are left? I count. One, two, 
3. 4, take away 1, equals 3. So here are all the butterflies. 1, 2, 3, 4. One butterfly flew away. 1. I count the butterflies that are left. 1, 2, 3. Three butterflies are left. Four, take away one, equals three. You are doing such a good job, an excellent job. Let's do another one. I will read. Sarah had seven lollipops. She gave her sister four lollipops. How many lollipops did Sarah remain with? Wow, those are lovely red lollipops. And I'm going to use my red counters to match it. I'm going to put out seven red counters. I'm not going to count. I want you to count for me. Did you get seven? Let's check. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven. Good. So Sarah had seven lollipops, and she gave her sister four. So I'm going to take away four. One, two, three, four. How many lollipops are left? Or how many counters I have? One, two, three. So seven take away four equals three. Here are all my lollipops. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And Sarah gave away four lollipops. One, two, three, four. How much is she left with again? Do you remember? I count the lollipops that are left. One, two, three. Three lollipops are left. Seven take away four equals three. I have a challenge for you. We have a number story to solve. Let's get started. There were six fishes in the ocean. Five fishes were caught. Boy, they were not lucky. How many fishes were left in the ocean? So there are my six fishes. Again, I'm going to use my counters to help you solve this. So we have six fishes. One, two, three, four, five, six fishes in the ocean. And five were very unlucky, they got caught. So let's take them away. One, two, three, four, five. How many do we have left? One. Six, take away five, equals one. Here are all the fishes. One, two, three, four, five, six. Five fishes were caught. One, two, three, four, five. I count the fishes that are left. Only one. One fish is left. Six, take away five, equals one. Give yourself a round of applause. So what we learned in this lesson, and there's Charlie, he's going to help us review. We learn that when we take away from a group, we are doing subtraction. We also learned that the subtraction number sentence reads something, take away something equals something. And here are some of the facts that we learned today. 7 take away 2 equals 5. 5 take away 3 equals 2. 
8 take away 4 equals 4. 4 take away 1 equals 3. You're going good. 9 take away 3 equals 6. six 7 take away 4 equals 3. And read the last one for me. 6 take away 5 equals 1. Thank you, boys and girls, for being here with me in this lesson. Till we meet again. Parents, please visit learn.moe.gov.tt for ECC, primary and secondary activities where we focus on helping students to connect and continue learning. Mm -hmm.